trying to find the perfect place to watch fireworks can be tricky, so today we're asking you to weigh in on some of the hot spots. So let's talk a, a, about this, because here's the thing. You can do this a couple of ways. You can tell us the best location in the Carolinas, which show is the best, but then you can also tell us where's that spot when we go to a specific fireworks show that gives you the optimal view. And we got a comment this morning from Rick Johnson who says, Romare Bearden Park. Yeah, that's definitely a good one because you also have, you know, the ballpark yeah, fireworks BB &T. too. And then he also said, or just off my balcony at the Catalyst, which I'm assuming is near Uptown Charlotte, and you can see all the fireworks going on. Buster and a couple other folks mentioned uh, Charlotte Motor Speedway. They've got their fireworks coming up Tuesday night. Wilson, I know you've been around here for a very long time. You've gone to a lot of fireworks shows. You have hosted a lot of fireworks shows. So I got to know from you, what's the best place? Uh, to me, the best place, and I really don't want to say this on TV because I'm going to ruin it now, right off Wilkinson Boulevard, okay? Okay. Uh, and when you get over there, wave at Paul Cameron, Channel 3, right behind the Channel 3 <laughs> building, right over there on Wilkinson Boulevard. You can see the whole city from there. You can wow. see fireworks going off all over the place. There's a little empty lot right there. Over there by, uh, by Classroom Central over there. We yep. go over there a couple times. Oh, if you remember, a couple weeks ago, I shared a, a sunrise picture. It looks just like that, but with fireworks. It's pretty cool. Okay, Ooh. but listen, who's better to ask to see fireworks than a firefighter over here? Matthew's a firefighter here. Uh, Chris, where's your spot to watch the fireworks? Uh, my favorite spot is uh, Kenilworth and Pearl Street. Off on the left hand mm -hmm. side, there's a soccer field. If you don't get there early, it's standing room only. Really? Okay, I hadn't heard about that it's one. That's perfect. pretty good. I got a couple people on Twitter that said the Whitewater Center is supposed yeah. to be pretty good. Uh, and this one's a pretty good one, guys, too. Jerry. Uh, Jerry at Wilson's World said, "The oaks in clover, we blow stuff up." <laughs> <laughs> so, you probably wouldn't be invited Why to that. So there you go, clover. I, I want to ask you about. There you go, guys. I, I used to work, and you used to work in that building over on Wilkinson Boulevard. Uh, that might not be the safest place to be with your family. Uh oh. Well, no, listen, go there on the 4th of July, but any other time, don't go there unless you're looking <laughs> okay, to get arrested for saying. various things. Oh, sure. <laughs> okay, no, don't go not, there. Yeah. But that's not hey, a good you know, area. if you're looking for that kind of thing, that's your spot. Yeah. <laughs> you know what is really safe? Derek James's house, where I spent my first 4th of July that's here. That's right. We had our own little fireworks display going on. Well, with the well they were sparklers, but yeah, that was, that was about all we had. Here's another uh, good one in Uptown, in front of Domino's Pizza on King Street. Parking lot is open and it faces the uptown fireworks. And then I, I love fireworks over water. I think oh, that is one yeah, of the best things too. you can possibly get. And Rusty Covington suggests Queen's Landing in Mooresville. Okay, good I got another one, watch. Lake Wiley from Ralph, who also says Carowinds. They must do oh, a yeah. good show. I didn't even think about that. Well, and I went there. to the uh, Mooresville uh, fireworks. Well, actually, it was in uh, Mike Thomas, the most well known thumb in all of North oh, America. Sure. He, he's, got the, he's got the He's got the perfect uh, view outside from his backyard. So you Does just he? set up the chairs in the backyard, boom, it's right in front of you. Uh, now, the problem is getting out of there after traffic. Well, exactly. That's, that's the other thing that could be. <laughs> Parking. Yeah. So it's tempting to do it in your own backyard sometimes, which I don't know how legal that is. But when I moved in, we were one of the new builds in the neighborhood, and they were like, when you, they were building your house, we tried to pull out the stakes because we didn't want anyone to move in there. That was the space that we used to use for, for fireworks, fireworks every year, and you ruined it. So <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I won't be doing fireworks this year off my balcony.